Deploying a virtual machine from a catalog can be useful for cloning an existing image. Sometimes, we need more flexibility and control over choices such as the operating system family and version and the amount of memory. In this video, we'll look at how to create a virtual machine from scratch in VMware vCloud Hybrid Service. Go ahead and log in. On the Dashboard tab, you can see a snapshot of your resources. Click the virtual data center where you want to create the virtual machine, and then within the Dashboard, click the Virtual Machines tab. The process of creating a virtual machine from scratch starts in the same way as creating a virtual machine from a catalog. Just click Add One. Rather than choosing from one of the catalogs, click Create My Virtual Machine from Scratch. In the VMware vCloud Director UI, you have the familiar option to add a vApp from the catalog. But instead, click Build New vApp to build a new virtual machine. Give it a simple name like Scratch VM. The description is optional, and for now you can use the default 20-day lease with no expiration. Go ahead and click Next. Because you're building from scratch, you don't need to look at any catalogs to find templates. You can just click New Virtual Machine and enter a name like Scratch VM. Select the hardware version. Here, hardware version 9 is fine. Select an operating system family, like Microsoft Windows, and then a specific operating system from the list. You can also customize your number of CPUs, amount of memory, hard disk size, and number of NICs from here. Once you're finished, click OK. You can see that the new virtual machine you've created from scratch is in the list of virtual machines. Click Next. For storage profile, there is only one to choose from at this point. For virtual data center, click the appropriate virtual data center, in this case SharePoint to store the new virtual machine with the rest of your virtual machines. Click Next. For Configure Virtual Machines, under Network, select the appropriate network, in this case, SharePoint Default Isolated, to connect to the isolated network. For this exercise, there is no need to connect to the routed network. For IP assignment, click DHCP, which is enabled by default for isolated networks, and because you will need this setting to obtain an IP address. Click Next twice, and then click Finish. VMware vCloud Director creates the virtual machine for you with the settings you specified. After it is finished, click the new machine, and then click Start. Switch back to the vCloud Hybrid Service UI. Close the new virtual machine on SharePoint window, and in the dashboard, click your virtual data center to see your new virtual machine named Scratch VM. For the new machine, you have all the same options as for a virtual machine created from a catalog. You can choose to power off, reset, register for backup, delete snapshot, or launch console. That's how you create a virtual machine from scratch in vCloud Hybrid Service.